Okay, what's up, guys? So, uh, I've been MIA. This is gonna go on my YouTube channel. I've been at MIA for a couple months. I had to give the pickup talk at the Sopot Summit in Poland. I'm co still currently in Europe. Decided to spend the next year, at least, out in Europe. Um, Sunny is gonna be jumping on the call from Strength by Sunny. In a moment, we're gonna be going over a new immersion program offering. Uh, some quick updates. My Facebook Live, or my uh, Instagram was targeted reported. I'm trying to get that back from Instagram. Um, I will be uh, starting a new Instagram if I'm unable to get that back. But some more updates. Um, currently at 951 late count, running a 12 girl rotation in Poland in Europe. And I will be, um, you know, just seeing those chicks out here, get the, getting new ones here and there, but the rate has slowed down a bunch. So 49 left to go for a thousand, but right now I'm mostly focused on the rotation and Sonny and I have some exciting stuff to talk about, about a new immersion program offering. So I'm gonna go ahead and add him into the call here. All right, we should be adding Sonny in here. Hey. You hear me? Yeah. Uh-oh. What's going on? Puerto Rico! No, I'm kidding. Um, uh, not much, man. Yeah, I mean, hope everyone's good out there. Um, it's been a great summer. Summer's winding down. Um, had a lot of fun. Um, you know, had a lot of fun past... Uh, Oh, yeah, it's been a great year, you know. You know, j if you were a big part of that, you know. You got to, you know, lift some weights, show you around, travel around Columbia, all over the U.S., teaching those uh, programs. And, uh, yeah, everything's good, you know. Traveled around for a bit. I'm getting back in the swing of things, uh, working on my uh, – working on the book. So, yeah. Yeah, so those of you guys that went aware, we did uh, a round of boot camps. We did New York. Uh, DC, um, what was it? Mont uh, no, Toronto. We did, San it was New York, DC, Toronto, San Diego, San Francisco, and then another, uh, and then another New York. It was, it was fun. It was those programs. You guys that don't know, um, Jamo and I, you know, we used to teach individually, uh, on our own uh, a couple years ago, um, for a couple years. And then we stopped a couple years ago to focus on other, uh, other business ventures, other pursuits. And, um, uh, yeah, I mean, it was a great experience. It was great. Um, getting back in the swing of things, those programs, you'd agree. I mean, they're, they're pretty, they're, they're pretty fun, you know, when you teach them. Yeah. But what, what we've seen, um, unfortunately <laughs> the trend in the community continues to get more away from results, more into woo woo, more into yeah. bullshit. And there's less, there's less than a handful of coaches we respect. Um, besides ourselves yeah. in the industry. So we wanted to come together to kind of uh, retake the, the reins and turn out some, some solid guys here. So yeah, what, um, yeah, go ahead. Oh, I was going to say, um, yeah, the programs we did, you know, they were a lot of fun. Very, very, um, very, uh, it was just great work with dudes from all different backgrounds all over the U S and Canada. Um, I think a lot of guys learned a lot. A lot of guys got a lot of value out of it. Um, I, I think a big thing we actually, um, as individuals and as a, as a team, we learned a lot too. And uh, one of the things I'm just looking at the notes here. Um, uh, one of the things you know, you see certain trends. You work with different guys from different backgrounds, different skill sets, and whatnot. So you see all these different trends, all these different learning experiences. I'd say, you know, we talked about this. The big thing. Um, the big theme that I think a lot of guys, I don't know if it's something that, you know, other coaches, other companies, they try to purposely hide or maybe they don't know it themselves. But, you know, a big thing that we agree on, you know, what is the dating and getting the life that you want uh, from that perspective? What is it at the end of the day? It's it's a business. It's sales. That's that's if there's one big secret, that's what it is. Yep. Yeah, so 
I know we've, we've said it a bunch of times. We're not going to be a dead horse, but we're very focused on results. Um, that's just not with pickup. We're going to be talking about a, a new offering we're putting together that's going to cover – you want to just give the high-level overview? Basically, it's going to cover all the dating stuff. It's going to cover all the fitness stuff. It's going to cover how to do well in business, how to carry yourself as an alpha guy. Um, what else? Yeah, um, well, well, what we did, we taught – just to recap, we taught these three-day programs where, you know, we pretty much, you know, we, we put guys through the ringer. You know, we really challenge guys to work on everything, you know, everything from their image, their self-image, you know, how they view themselves, working on that, working obviously on their fitness, their health, social skills. And then obviously a big part of social skills is uh, actual game tactics, the, uh, you know, what you could from a pure there is there's a lot of you know if this is a business this is sales there are a lot of there are a lot of tactics there's a lot of strategy that does go into this it's not um it's not necessarily you know going in there and hoping for the best and just you know you know approach 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 and do all this there is a there is a strategy behind this and some of you guys have, have gone so far as to comment that um you know you know you know jay Mulvin, sunny it seems like you guys uh um, you know, differ on certain things. Yeah, of course, you know, every, no one's exactly the same. Everybody's going to differ on certain things. But, you know, I put out a post, you guys that follow me on on Instagram or even friends of me on Facebook, I put out a post on the importance of fundamentals. Fundamentals, it, it does indeed win championships. And one of the things that, you know, when I made that post, you know, I was thinking about a lot of things, sports, food, fighting, um, things like that. But again, a big part of it is the dating stuff. Yeah, obviously the dating stuff's on my mind. You know, I, I, you know, I've been on this side of the internet for like, you know, four or five years. But fundamentals, fundamentals win championships. So you might see someone like a Jay Mulder or myself or anybody else that kills it in, in this part of the, you know, the dating life aspect. We might have different mindsets, different little tweaks here and there. But the fundamental, that fundamental of actually being a man, going in, owning it, and going for it, and strategically leading the interaction from open to close, that meat and potatoes right there, that fundamental is the same with every guy, no matter what their mindset is, no matter what their background is, guys who actually, you know, get results, the fundamental of being an alpha, man, an alpha male and leading the interaction and guiding it from open to close, that fundamental is always there and that's something when you get that for yourself when you develop that for yourself that's something that it, it is it's it's a big question you know guys growing up they want to know how to get chicks once you have that fundamental down it's something that mindset that confidence you get from that it's something that you can apply not just the dating stuff you can apply it towards literally every aspect of your life to get confidence you know um yeah, so, and that's yeah, something that that's something that we, what we try to, to preach to people we work with and people that we're going to work with in the future. Yeah. So the big piece of the program is the first big core piece is going to be the outer game tactics. We've stood behind that for the longest time. However, outer game tactics don't work if the guy is a pussy, if the guy's not an alpha male. So that would be a large focus as well, breaking you out of that pussy mindset, that beta male mindset. And that's going to come with fitness, with fashion, with boundaries, all sorts of exercises. Um, and we're very, very straight with our clients. So it's going to be very brutal. So this won't be for the week of heart. But that's what guys need to hear. At the Soapot Summit during my talk, I asked the whole crowd, how many of you guys here are pussies? Raise your hand. And I think four guys out of maybe 200 raised their hand. And I said, well, I can guarantee you 95% plus of you are doing shitty with girls. And it's largely because you're a pussy. And it's largely because the girls sense that. And it's largely because the girls don't want to be with the pussy. And nobody wants to admit it. No one wants to look in the mirror. Everyone wants to think that they're improving their pickup life or improving their, excuse me, skills or whatever just by going out or just by doing reference experience things or just by doing woo-woo things. And really yeah. what's happened in the community and what I've seen is the trend is that just like in Christianity where they say, blessed are the meek, blessed are the poor, blessed are the, you know, all the low qualities have been flipped upside down and glorified and power and autonomy and strength have been demonized. 
And that's exactly what's happening here. It's being, it's being done by old school cults like RSD. It's being done by new wave cult movements like Social Prime, where they're saying, results don't matter anymore. You need to have good feelings. We're going to make you emotional. Yeah. We're going to explore childhood stuff. RSD is going to make you jump up and down holding hands. You're going to all bond together at the diners and all this stuff, and no one's getting laid. Okay, And that's, that's the big issue. And I, what I've yeah. seen with a lot of the social prime programs is the instructors are still using external game tactics, which is what you need to get laid in this game. And they're pulling for the students and then they're having trains and gangbangs and stuff like that. I'm going to make a whole separate video giving my critique of how total social prime is completely off in left field now and has lost my respect. Um, not the guys that run it, but the, the teachings they're, they're teaching. Um, so, yeah, I mean, that's, and you know, not to, um, you know, I, I do, because I think a lot of guys get into this stuff and, you know, they want to improve their confidence. They want to, you know, whatever past pains that they may have had, you know, they definitely, they want to alleviate those. And they do, I, I think you can make an argument that um, this, like you improve various aspects of your life, you know, the deeper into the shit you go. If you do it right, um, you know, there's a lot you can potentially improve on. Um, I think where the confusion is, is that the core reason why, you know, why do guys get into, there's really, there's only a few reasons why guys get into this. They either, they want to get more chicks, get hotter chicks, or, you know, thinking long-term down the road, you know, they want to get, you know, chicks Fitting. that they want to get into a relationship with, whether it be a long-term girlfriend or even, or even get married, you know, but that fundamental of, results getting chicks a lot of people they seem to have lost uh touch of and you know it's one of my favorite things i was actually going to put something on this on uh, instagram but it's same thing you know the big mystery in 2010 why did lebron leave the Cavs originally why did he sign with the miami heat it was a very easy you know he could have went anywhere but it was a very easy sell for pat riley what did pat riley do very simple he came in with his seven nba championship rings and he said why you know why should you sign with the heat Hardware. This is why it's about it's about winning rings. At the end of the day, it's about winning. Whether it be winning rings, championships, medals, you know, metrics, money, chicks. It's about it's about hardware. What are you what are you getting out of it? You need to get something tangible out of it. You know, if you know if you're spending all your time in a city partying and you're not getting anything tangible out of it, whether it be chicks, friends you know, things, of, you know, things that, you know, you can fall back on. Um, if you're not getting that kind of stuff, then you're not, you can tell yourself, you know, you have all these emotions and dopamine flowing and tell yourself that this is great. But at the end of the day, if you don't have anything to show for it, you're not winning. And that's something that we've tried to, we tried, you know, we've done that individually on our own and we came together and did it on our own and did it together. We, we've taught people how to, win get real wins real tangible wins and you know uh, the results we've got we've helped dudes get for themselves and build for themselves long term speak for themselves um yeah so it's, yeah, it's, so, it's important to point yeah. out though that just uh, the real big trend like the all the like hurrah in the community now is all this like anti results stuff and guys that are focused on results like us are painted out to be the bad guys and another big misconception is Guys think that if you're just focused on getting more chicks in your life and hotter chicks in your life, that that's all, you're, that's all you can be focused on or that it's just totally one-dimensional or that it's unhealthy in some way or whatever. Guys are – what I always tell guys is say stuff like this. I say, why are you going out to do night game? Is it to get chicks or is it to practice game? Why are you going out to do day game? Why are you swiping on Tinder? Unless you're purposely hoping to perform poorly – or to perform suboptimally or to perform worse than a bunch of other guys, which I don't think any of us are. We're all trying to get better at this, which is why we're on the forums, why we're buying products, why we're buying training. Then there's no argument there. We're doing this to get good at it. So why not get as best as you can and learn optimized strategies? Why is it, all, why is it being so glorified to do bad at this? Like I, I, I've told this story before. I met a guy in Vegas, good looking guy, was able to converse totally fine. He recognized me, came up, said, I really love your stuff, blah, blah, blah. But 
I'm in the Vegas immersion program. I've been doing it for like eight months. And I said, how many girls have you banged in that eight months? It's always a good metric to see how someone's doing skill wise. Zero. And he said, Todd told him his game is really improving. So I'm seeing lots of guys coming out of programs thinking their game is improving. All this stuff is getting better and they're not getting laid. Like if you're not getting laid, you're not, you're not regularly fucking hot chicks. There's a big problem. Yeah. There's, a lot, there's a lot more to becoming a well-rounded man. Without, without dithering around, let's get into the, the meat of what we want to offer in this uh, immersion program. Yeah. Yeah. So basically, you know, if there's one golden nugget to the one secret everybody's avoiding, this is a business. This is sales. You know, whatever you want to do with your dating life. But at the end of the day, it's about wins. It is about lead generation to lead closing. That's, that's the simple part of it. And of course, you know, there's, you'll, you'll have fun and grow as a person, but you know, you can't lose sight of that. Um, yeah. So what we're going to do, you know, we had a lot of fun doing these programs. Um, we're always, we're, you know, we always enjoy working with, um, you know, people from different backgrounds. Um, we're always looking to sort of raise the bar. What we're doing, we're going to run it back. You know, I mentioned that, um, I was interested in coaching again, um, uh, we're going to run it back. We're going to do things a little bit differently this time. Um, we previously, our programs were three days. We are announcing we are going to be offering a six-day um, a six day program. It's going to be um, much more in-depth. Uh, um, there's going to be a lot more uh, covered during this. Obviously, you have twice as much time, but it's going to be six days. Um, and, you know, if you are interested in that, um, we will disclose all the details for that. But basically, we're offering a six-day program. I mean, I'm looking at the dates here. The dates, uh, what do we say? November 5th through the 11th. Um, we haven't narrowed down the exact city yet, but we are thinking it's most likely going to be either New York City or Miami. And basically, again, six-day program. We're in the swing of things now. You know, these programs that we just taught in the early spring, we, um, it had been a couple of years since we taught those programs. Now we're in the swing of things. You know, the game's kind of changed over the past couple of years. The most up, the most up to date, the most, um, I guess, uh, advanced instinct, um, that could be applied towards going out and making friends and, you know, building the lifestyle that you want is going to be applied toward this. And then this program Again, this isn't what separates, you know, the duo of myself and Jamo. Again, this isn't just, well, a lot, of, a lot separates us, to be honest. But this isn't just, you know, to have you just be an approach monkey for three days or, in this case, six days straight. You, you know, we're going to be working on everything. Health, fitness, supplementation, uh, nutrition. Um, obviously, the, the older guys uh, or even the younger guys that are interested in learning more about you know, becoming fully optimized physically. Um, yeah. Yeah. I'm just going to say this, the, the big goal, the big takeaway here is if you put me or you put Sonny into any city, yes. I don't even care if it's a small city, within three to four weeks, we're going to have five to 10 girl rotation. We're going to have cool friends. We're going to be hooked up at the nightclubs. We're going to be having cool hobbies going on. It's to build yeah. like a dream lifestyle in any city and be able to do it very quickly. Both of us travel a lot. Um, yeah. I've lived all over the world. Sonny's, Sonny's lived in lots of different places and we're able yeah. to generate from scratch, like a lifestyle that people will never even come close to scratching mm -hmm. the surface of in their whole life. We can generate that yeah. very, very quickly. So I always tell guys like if, when you're running like the machine, so to speak, and everything's dialed in even to, to some level of proficiency, um, you can build a really solid rotation in two to three weeks. It's, it's really that fast. Mm -hmm. And you can make a whole bunch of awesome friends. Like I've been in Europe for two months. I've got 12 awesome girls right now that are regulars. There's like yeah. all these new dates I'm canceling. There's all these like things people are inviting me to do, parties and different shit that I don't have time for. Um, people are asking about Dallas, Sweden. We didn't decide on the city yet. We have um, initial interests and we're going to be very upfront about about the price and this isn't going to be for most guys being straight up front yeah this is going to be uh ten thousand dollars us to start um mm -hmm. and we're going to do a couple pilot things where we're going to they're going to be very well structured and stuff like that but we're going to um be refining it and probably raising the price level because whether or not you guys know there's a few other coaches out there 
uh, that don't even bother dicking around in the community forums. And they are having like 10 or 14 day immersions where they're charging $15,000, $20,000. Um, and this isn't like a big money grab thing. It's more, if we're going to be investing our time since Sonny's writing his second book, I'm running multiple businesses besides pickup. If we're going to be sitting down and trying to churn out, because really there's no real superstars in the community right now. Like there's, like, like we said, there's, there's about a handful of guys that we respect in terms of really crushing it. And we can make guys like that. Um, we are the two best duo to make guys like that. We will probably hire on guys that we train as coaches to go under us as we expand. Um, we already have some guys we've trained that are, have been with three or 400 chicks now that we've trained three, four years ago that we're gonna be having assist. But the point is, this isn't just going to be some, we're going to teach you how to do night game or we're going to teach you how to pull chicks. That that's obviously part of it. But this is really yeah. so that you can have your dream lifestyle as fast as you want it and as optimized as you want it. And it's going to be mostly for wealthy people that can afford a $10,000 yeah. program. Yeah, I like that. And, and again, it, it coincides with our beating around the bush. You know, what's the, the lifestyle every guy, the majority of guys want, at least at one point or another. It is that. It is having hot chicks in their life, having cool friends, and being socially connected. Anytime any guy is in a city, whether they move to a new city or even just, you know, they want to start fresh within their own. That, that, that's what a guy, a guy who isn't married and still, you know, in a single days, you know, living a single life. So that's what they want. You know, I'm, you know guys may deny it, but that's, that's the truth. Every guy wants that. They want hot chicks. They want to have cool friends. They want to have their choice of, you know, social events and being invited to shit and being socially connected. And the point is, you know, j Mulva and I both, we have a track record of traveling around and, you know, going to a new city solo. We've done different cities all over the world by ourselves. And being able to do that, literally having that set up within the first, really realistically within the first week. And that's what we're doing. We're coming together six days and we are going to show guys the ropes on how to, how to do that. Starting with that first day, starting with, you know, along the way, improving everything you can within yourself, putting your best foot forward, learning, learning social instinct, learning how to navigate through social situations, learning how to make connections. And then of course, which doesn't need to be explained the whole archive of knowledge collectively that Jamie overnight bring to the table. It literally, it literally is. It's all of that packaged into one six day program, a six day intensive program. And that's what we're offering those dates again, November 5th through the 11th. It depends on, you know, initial interest, but we're, we're leaning towards either New York city or Miami. And if you're interested, um, contact us. We'd love to work with you. We'd love to hear. Yeah, you. We're, we're open to other cities too. We, we already have a few guys that, that we've mentioned this to that are down to do it. Like we, Sonny and I have been teaching for five, six years. We have uh, rich clients from the past where money isn't an object that they can afford something like this. And they're down to go to whatever city. Um, we're probably going to be including uh, housing for you guys as well in that price. So in case you have to travel to a different city. Um, but really this is, you know, you're going to get all the secret sauce stuff and we're going to try to cover as much as we possibly can in six days that factors into having a rich, fulfilled alpha male life. So this is going to go far beyond pickup. Um, it mm -hmm. will be fully comprehensive on pickup. Make no mistake about that. But it's going to go into all the other areas that make you uh, the most effective man you can be. And, you know, like we said, a lot of, a lot of the guys in the community are pussies. A lot of the guys in the community um, need a, need a shell shock. This is going to be, we don't want, we don't want to send you off as a beta male when you leave the program. You're going to be not physically swift, but we're going to put you through the ringer. Yeah. So yeah, feel free to uh, suggest cities on uh, message me on Facebook. I'm going to put this on my YouTube EP dating coach at gmail.com or mm -hmm. sunny Arbato at gmail.com. I'll put those links. Yes. Um, ask comment or ask questions in the comments or email us. Um, we're going to be running the pilot program on November 5th through 11th this year. Um, yeah. We'll put out a more official schedule 
of the, the program offering. We'll probably put up a website uh, sometime in the next few weeks. So did you have anything else? And I'm going to start again for my viewers. I'm going to start uh, regularly posting uh, videos again. Uh, one of my videos I've been preparing is a kind of run through of the who's who's of the who's who of the pickup coaching world. Yeah. Which will be fun. It'll be a laugh riot. Um, did you have anything else? Oh, we, we can mention, I have a note here. Um, we firmly believe at this point that most of successful game is your ability to generate leads, manage those leads, and close those leads. So mm -hmm. those are the big three areas. Um, either you're not doing your in-person game strong enough and therefore not acquiring enough leads, which in, in which case you need to improve your game skill in combination with running more volume. Um, you're not effectively managing the leads to get them set up for meetups, which is largely text game. And then the ability to run your dates and close your dates and also handle reschedules and cancels and flakes and all the different yeah. objectives you get in order to set up the dates. Um, what differentiates your teachings from other companies? Um, I've talked to lots of guys. I'm like very interested in like, is any company producing hardcore players? And so far there has yet to be one that I've found really. Um, I would say Jason James comes closest out of New York city. Um, but really most, most companies are falling flat because they're giving you a bunch of woo stuff. I had a guy that took a $15,000 program with James Marshall for 10 days in June. He started the program at six lays. He came out of that program at six lays. And then we did a special, oh, fuck, there's a chick here. <laughs> All right, we'll end this in a second. Um, we did a special two week uh, immersion together, which is where I, I kind of got some of the ideas that I need to start doing this with more guys. We brought them from six into 14 lays. So we more than doubled. But I went through all the ends and to my secret sauce of, of what I'm actually doing. We improved his mindsets, all this stuff. And I said, what did you get out of that program? And the way he described it, that $15,000 program, was that it was just a lot of feel-good stuff. He said, that program made me feel really good about a whole bunch of stuff, but it didn't really bring any tangible results. And yeah. we'll give you the feel-good. You know, we, that's part of the fucking, you know, we're going to have to add that in as like a little sauce or a little frosting on the cake. But we're going to give you the meat potatoes which is what really matters like he, he said your program was infinitely more more valuable because now he's able to fuck hot girls for life whereas this other program he heard a lot of nice things it's kind of like watching a movie you watch it you leave and then and then that's it whereas this is equipping you and changing your mindsets and changing your skill set so that you're able to go and dominate so that's that's the big difference yeah, I mean, there's tons of differences, but differences in between, you know, again, teachings that are different are geared towards tangible results. And then, of course, you know, it's well documented. You know, you, you do enough research on a lot of these coaches and stuff. You'll you'll find dudes that that don't that don't get laid. You know, there's like and again, I won't name names, here, but there are literally dating coaches out there making a living who they, they don't go on dates with chicks that they don't like they I'm never a bank chick. I'm going to name them all in my, my roast video. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, but, you know, again, the big thing is if, you know, dating and getting laid is something you're interested in. It's like anything. You want to learn from dudes who have a track record of success. Not a, like, first and foremost, in their own lives. You want to have, a, you know, dudes that have that track record of success. You know, if you want to, if you want to learn how to make a billion dollars, you know, it would make sense to seek out someone who has made a billion dollars. You know, if you want to, if you want to learn how to be, uh, um, you know, a good fighter, you know, you, you probably wouldn't uh, this you know, want to take advice from your local gym teacher. You'd probably want to talk to a professional fighter. Um, but uh, yeah, I, I mean, that's it. Like I said, guys, you know, like we said, you know, we have this program November 5th through 11th. Six day program. If you're interested, contact both of us. We'll put the we'll put the contact info um, uh, in the descriptions. Okay. Sound good, man? Yeah, yeah. Good call. Um, I'll post this on my YouTube, and we'll talk soon. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, send me a copy. I'll post it on mine too.
Okay, sounds good. All right, see you guys. Okay.